Hello there, my beautiful people, my wonderful family. Greeting from Family Chef to you. It's watermelon season. Let's eat a lot of watermelon before it goes, okay? Summertime, there's a lot of watermelon. Anything that comes in the season, make sure you eat a lot of them because fruit is good for you. So we are going to make another watermelon dessert, okay? Bear with me Wow, I wash the watermelon. I have my knife. I'm going to cut it in half. So, if you, today is your first time, welcome to my channel. My name is Family Chef. Nice to meet you. This video will be so short because I know you guys don't have much time. Good evening, good morning, wherever you are. Before I cut the watermelon, we are going to need uh, hot water to dis dissolve our gelatin. Okay, so let me put this in on the fire to boil them. And those are the ingredients. Just three or four ingredients, that's it. Watermelon strawberry gelatin non flavor gelatin okay so we are going to mix this with the watermelon juice see how this is going to look beautiful amazing we are going to cut the watermelon in half Okay, so this is how it looks. I'm going to save this for another recipe. All right, so we are using half of it for now. It's okay if you cut it and it's not equal, you can still go ahead and trim it so it becomes equal. All right, now we are going to scoop the watermelon out. Scoop everything out. Now let's get our scoop for the help of the spoon we are scooping everything out because of time I'll do this off camera okay then we'll go ahead and do the rest okay now you can see we scoop everything off and it's here all right this process is very important. Make sure you put, you take something like paper towel to dry all the excess liquid in the watermelon shell, okay? So this time I have my paper towel here. What I'm doing is trying to get all the liquid out from it. All right, I'm going to put it aside and bring my blender so we can blend the watermelon. Okay, now I put the watermelon in the blender. We are going to blend it, okay? The juice is the one we need, so let's go. Okay, let's strain it. I have my strainer here. Let's put everything in this bowl and strain it so we can get rid of the pulp. With the help of the spoon, all you do is just go ahead and strain everything. Oh yeah, the blender is good, so it blends everything smooth. All right. Okay, now we put the watermelon juice aside. Let's have this bowl. I have plain gelatin here, okay? We're going to need about 
two tablespoons. Actually, two teaspoons because each each packet is I think it's one one teaspoon. So two teaspoons goes here, and let's add about two tablespoons of water, cold water, please. Make sure you mix with cold water, okay? We are going to hydrate it a bit. Okay. This is how it looks. Let's put it aside and bring this bowl. Okay. This is plain gelatin. Let's have our mixer here. Okay, now let's go for strawberry flavor gelatin. Okay, one part. Going to pour all this here. This we are going to use half water to dissolve it. Two cups or one and a half cup of hard water. Miss, miss, miss. All right. Miss until all dissolved. So we are using two different kinds of gelatin. This is strawberry flavor gelatin, and this is plain plain gelatin all right okay the one that we hydrated is right here we are going to add it into the hot water please be careful this one need a lot of patience you have to make sure all the plain gelatin is dissolved with the strawberry gelatin Okay, so then we need time to dissolve everything. All right, okay, now strawberry dessert, strawberry gelatin, and plain gelatin is dissolved. Okay, the plain one we use cold water. You remember to use cold water, then you use hard water for the strawberry one. Now that everything is dissolved we are going to add back our juice watermelon juice that we blend add back here so together i use two cups or one and a half cups of water to dissolve the gelatin and i use about three cups so let's add a little more because i have a juice one more cup then that's it okay so together watermelon juice is three cups and one and a half cup of water to dissolve it. We are going to bring our watermelon back. It's right here. Okay, let's take the paper towel out. Remember we drain it. So this is going back to the watermelon cup or whatever we call it. All right, this is going to refrigerator for eight hours or overnight. Okay, so guys, I will see you tomorrow or six to eight hours later to show you how this look. And the refrigerator, it looks good already. Uh, don't bother all this um, pop that come out, okay? You can scoop it out or leave it. It's still going to be okay. All right. It looks good. Okay. Now the watermelon is ready. It's in the refrigerator for eight hours. Okay. So that's how it look. I put it uh, this thing because it wasn't steady. So let's put it here. Okay, I'll leave it here for now. What we are going to do is trim it. I'm gonna trim it so it will be equal. Nice. Ding, 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 ding.
there you see nice so you see i trim it nice i want you to know if you cut it and it's a little bit over here you can trim it down Goodness gracious. My goodness gracious. Is it not amazing how it looks? So this is the end of my show. Because you know what people don't like the watermelon, like they eat it raw like that. If you spice this and put it like this, everyone will love it and the kids will love it. Let's try. Mm. Oh my God, it's like you're eating jello. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So nice. Oh my goodness, look at that. Just look at this is it not amazing good uh, this is the one i bite let's try again okay i guess this is the end of my watermelon It looks so delicious, amazing, great. If you do this, you encourage your kids to eat what they don't like and they even don't know that they are eating watermelon. You took the watermelon into the next level. Just look at that. Isn't that amazing? Guys, this is the end of my show. Next time, I will bring more, more watermelon recipe. Okay? Thanks for watching. Please, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please, please, please subscribe to this channel for me. And hit the notification bell. So anytime I post the video, you'll be the first to watch. Thanks for watching. Good night.